Nice body looks nice. Almost as nice as mine. Yeah. Yeah, almost. Howdy, folks. We're going back to you, me, and the movies. And guess what? What? We're into a new month. Mm -hmm. and we got a theme for this month. March, March, March. What happens in March? I mean, nothing special about March. Just I've picked out a genre we're going to watch this month. Swords and Sorcerers. Okay. And we're going to kick it off with one of my childhood favorite films. The Beastmaster. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Now. Looks horrible. The Beastmaster was played on TV constantly when I was growing up. TBS okay. stood for the Beastmaster Station. HBO means, hey, Beastmaster's on. <laughs> nice, okay. And TNT played Beastmaster more than Gone with the Wind. Wow. So it was, hey, Beastmaster's on. Let's watch it. How long is it? Does that matter? It does to When me. you're watching a movie called The Beastmaster? It definitely it's does It's about to Dar me. the Beastmaster. Dar. And he can talk to animals. Of course he can. So. All right, well, I've never heard of it. What rock have you been living under? You've never well, heard I of it. Well, I maybe I've heard of it, but I have no idea what it's about. I think you'll recognize the star, Mark Singer. Mark Singer. But, uh, yeah. Name sounds familiar. But, yeah, we're, we're, we're starting into this, so your expectations for when we watch Conan next are, like, this movie is okay. Conan's going to be awesome. <laughs> right? Really low expectations. Well, you got your sword ready? <laughs> All right. Totally. If you could talk to one animal, what would you? What, who would you want to talk to? Okay. Howdy, obviously. Howdy. Yeah. I mean, he kind of understands you, anyways. Right, but wouldn't it be great if you just knew exactly what he was thinking? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, should we jump in and see what kind of animals he talks to? Let's do it. Let's do it. But first, like, comment, subscribe, come hang out with us for the Beast Master. The Beast Master, and check out our Patreon link down below for early access to our videos, fun comedy, access to pull ups, big orange text. Links down there. Check it out. Let's watch The Beastmaster. All right. Let's get this party started. Now oh, that's a beast that needs to be mastered. That's what they say about you. The roach. That's a leisure investment company. Yeah, I've always wanted to have a leisure investment I company. I know, they invest in leisure. I love that. But some kind of cat. The Beastmaster. Rip Torn. I like Rip Torn. If you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a ball. That's right. Also, just like how cool that somebody named their kid Rip Torn. Yeah. Maybe it's a stage, stage name. It's probably a stage name. But it's still cool. Maybe not, though. You never know. Maybe I'll look that up. Elmore Raul Torn. Yep. Just went by Rip. Does that mean we're going to watch Braveheart? Maybe. I've always wanted to see that. I don't think there's any sorcerers in Braveheart, though. There are, oh, that's a... It's a historical fiction. Quantifier here yeah, is it has to fantasy. have swords and sorcery. Yeah. Not just one or the other. Conan has sorcery? Oh, I see why you like to watch Beastmaster as a kid. Get some, like... Grindage and butt cheeks. I was just dancing for you like that. The city of Arak, the god Ar has spoken. Sweet nose piece. In horrible, the prophecy dooms you. I must know what prophecy. Oh, oh, their faces. Classic butter faces. You will die at the hands of Zed's unborn son. 
You will die tonight! Eyes for King Zed! Lots of thigh. Oof. I have been told you are planning a child sacrifice. Not a, not a good look. The unborn child is yours. Then rest. How dare you! It must be cut from its mother. Branded with the sign of R. And sacrificed. Sounds normal. Not my kind of religion. Fanatic. That dude's crazy. Yeah, does people kill themselves? What's that do? No idea. So they put the baby in the cow? That's some witchcraft. That's weird. <laughs> Poor cow. Why did the cow need to die? If she's gonna kill the mom. Why not just cut it out of the mom? It seemed like an unnecessary step. Yeah. You had to smuggle it out somehow. Everybody's going to notice a screaming baby leaving a castle. I'm just going to care about a cow. It's probably true. Oh. Nice throw. Butterfaces. <laughs> Witches are crazy. <gasps> oh, he's so, so beautiful. What a guy. What a uh, guy. He's just a traveling salesman, you think? This donkey Definitely. coming back home and stumbled across a baby to save. He lives like an Ewok. There's no trees. Just tree houses. Right. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Show me. Tease. You old fool! <laughs> Could have chopped your fucking head off, but man, that was great. <laughs> What's in the bushes? That's a real bear. Dr. Doolittle. Hmm. Sweet. He was just looking for some picnic baskets. What happened here today? Must never be known. You have powers unlike anyone in the village. To touch a beast up here? How hard would it be to keep a secret about talking to animals? I mean, if people believed it. They're like, okay, yeah. Dar, the crazy guy, thinks he can talk to bears. <laughs> Fucking idiot. Oh, watch out of the rope burns and your inner thighs. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> That would not feel good. It's probably a soft rib. 
freaking still like groin burns. That dog just said, throw the stick. He's like, okay, fine, yeah. I, I can speak to dogs too. Absolutely. What's that, Lassie? Tommy's stuck in the well? Got that wings on that helmet. No one's crossing that line. He's drawn a line in the sand. Looking on my back, do you mean the boobies? I mean, like, just a little old village. Yeah, they're just trying to... Minding their own business. Farm and trade as much as they can with friendlies. He has eyes on the, the head honcho. Oh, such a good boy. <gasps> oh, how fucking rude. Who killed the dog? This is just like John Wick. Good boy still pulling him around with the arrow in his chest. Aww. Got eyes like a hawk. His nostrils are as big as yours. I think we might be related. No shit. It's definitely your family's nose. Yeah. Kind of looks like my dad did back in the day. Yeah, honestly. I mean, geez, impaled them all in spikes. Everyone's dead. Even that dog's playing dead really well, isn't he? He probably put it to sleep. Oh, yeah. The way his neck's dangling, you think they actually killed a dog for this? <laughs> You're right, he's probably, it's, um, what's it called? Under. Oh, yeah. Burying his dog with his dad. Hmm. The dog's still breathing. His body looks nice. Almost as nice as mine. Yeah. Yeah, almost. <laughs> His first real animal friend was that a hawk eagle falcon it's like a hawk that's what i need to work out with just big stick yeah. we just gotta find you a real big stick beautiful bird some sort of raptor right yeah He's like, this is lots lighter than that stick. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet sword skills. Hey! Oh, thieves? <clears throat> what do they need with a belt? Maybe they're trying to bind their nest together. Ouch, 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 ouch. Oh no. Quicksand. You two got me into this, now get me out. Thanks. Make yourself big. And then kick, 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 kick. How is a ferret gonna save you from quicksand? Yeah, sharp teeth. 
<laughs> yeah, just like that. We'll save him back, butthead. Now we're like, oh god, that sucked. <laughs> I'm gonna name you Kodo. You get a name too, Podo. Kodo and Podo. Kodo and Podo. Kodo and Podo. I always wanted ferrets growing up. Ooh. Never got one though. Maybe someday. Stinky little rodents. <laughs> That's a golden eagle. Could be. Go bite their asses. Go. Where's the hawk lookout? It always comes back. Can't shoot that with our arrows. Lunchtime. Panther. Feel bad for that extra. It's a big cat. I'll never work in Hollywood again. I have my eyes. I have my cunning. And now I have strength. Yeah, it is a golden eagle. That's supposed to be a black panther, but it's actually a tiger painted black. Is it? Yeah. Because tigers are easier to work with. Than panthers? Yeah. It's interesting. Both big cats, you'd think they'd be similar. I mean, how many tin cougars do you see? Was this on network television? But it was on HBO. Hello, boobies. At least they brought their flotation devices with them. <laughs> Well, she's not very good at the breaststroke, stroke, though. She needs the flotation devices to keep her up. <laughs> that poor tiger is just pissed about being black. He's just pissed that somebody spray painted him. But if we show no fear, he might escape. <laughs> <laughs> nice wingman. I'll accept this as payment. Mm. She has, she seems to be enjoying it so much. Who are you? I am Kiri. Slave to the priest of the Temple of Or. She sounds familiar. Your name's Tanya Roberts. Hmm. You would do well to forget me and follow the Jens. With them, you could die like a man. Not so with the priests of Ar. Goodbye, Dar. Charlie's Angels. Yeah. And she's in a Bond movie. She's a Bond girl. Oh, yeah, that's probably where I recognize her from. I think this is the movie that launched her, though. Oh, yeah. yeah. It wasn't Charlie's Angels. It wasn't Charlie's Angels. So. She was in the last season of Charlie's Angels, not oh. like the whole show. That was about the same time. Then she was in a view to the kill in 1985. Oh, and she's Donna's mom on 19, in the 70s show. I don't remember Donna's mom. These people like to sleep in trees, huh? Not off the ground. Oh, this is where they keep their slaves in these pods or something? Cocoons. Chrysalis? 
What would you classify that as? Gross. Cannibals. Pupa? Sure. I don't think it's that important. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, what the fuck? Like he was safer in the cage. You think? You don't seem scared of a tiger. I'm gonna take your leave, sir. Well, they don't like birds. Oh. They worship birds. Just don't get too close. He was like, I'm just gonna quietly, slowly walk this way. Everyone, keep your hands to yourself. Uh -huh. Parting gift? Does he belong to them now? He has, he has their blessing. It's like a hall pass next time he encounters one. Yeah. Shows him his hey, back. I know you guys. He found the Aztecs. No. Oh boy. Looks familiar. It's not a very inviting road. Is this village destroyed too? Or this town? City? No. Oh, this was his father's castle. His father? Remember they had that symbol above the gate? At the beginning of the movie. Oh, oh. <clears throat> it's actual father. Yeah. Hagar, receive this child as a gift from your devoted servant. Frame. The bar is not yet satisfied. No, not her. One child sacrifice wasn't enough today. Mm. He said his god wasn't. Maybe his god wants him to throw himself in that fire, huh? It's one strong eagle. Kid's just flying through the air right now. And he's gone. I has spoken! He wants your children! Let him from us. Seemed like a pretty piss poor interpretation. <laughs> Ferrets are like bloodhounds, too. Apparently. Who'd have known? I have something for you. It's your kid. Now get the fuck out of this town. Come inside. At least let me offer you a meal. Birds are like, yes, please. <laughs> Did somebody say food? Said our king is imprisoned in a pyramid. His son disappeared. The Juns put their demon high priest, Mayax, in power. What about the girl? He's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't give a shit about what that guy's doing. I just want the girl. <laughs> Which way did the Jun Horde go? To the north. But Mayax promises they shall return. Then so shall I. Keep her hidden. So they don't try to sacrifice just her again. Down to be like, I could have sworn their kid was sacrificed. 
and a bird flew away with it. I want this stranger. Bring him to me, this master of the beasts. This ring will lead you to him. Like a metal detector? Beep, beep. Beep, 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 It's a beast master detector. Oh, this noise. Creepy. You guys are stealthy. He's like, I'm trying! Kill him now! I'm trying! He's like, I did not want to be eaten by a tiger. Oh no. Oh shit. They had a tiger booby trap? No! <laughs> Mr. McDowell from Coming to America. Oh, yeah. McDowell's, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Beastmaster. Use, use a stick. It's a lever. Is he yours? We fight together sometimes. Sometimes you just... Licks his balls and says, yeah, you, he, you fight your own fights. Yeah, he's his own person. Or he's his own tiger, you know. I'm Dar. Of the Emerites. There are no more Emerites. He knows. There's safety in numbers. Perhaps we should travel together. Just double his team size. <laughs> it is now time for him to free his father. The king. I have just come from Arak. Mayax has total power. It will be difficult to defeat him. He will not stop me from freeing my father. His son, his, his dad's the king? So I mean the brothers? Or they had the wrong baby. <laughs> this is Podo and Kodo. They steal just about anything they can get their hands on. Rings. Trinkets, stones. Lady bras. I like that ring, keep it. Oh no. Yeah. Look. Explain this. I met a slave girl near a temple. Poto must have stolen it. That's why I'm following her. To rescue her before she's put to death. We leave at dawn. She's somebody special then? What's he looking for? Don't know. I mean, knowing this guy, it's that girl, but. Five women in white. Surrounded by priests in red. You're right. They're to be sacrificed. Better hurry. Gotta save him from being sacrificed. Hmm, making a raft. Brilliant. Build a boat. A really fancy boat. Maybe they just found it on the coast. Like, oh, yeah, I just got lucky. We'll take this. Oh, it's a ferry. Ah. Uh. I guess this is happening. Tie them. 
no. Ah, uh, shit. I think they're horrible shots, and crossbows take a while to reload. Mm -hmm. Nice. <laughs> Who's got the oars? Maybe he can like talk to some fish to help steer oh, yeah. or something. Float us this way. Oh, he's got the thing on the back. That's just like a steerer, right? That's what it's a steerer, whatever the hell it's called. Where are the other girls? <laughs> There's oh, no, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Weren't there four of them? Only wanted to save the one. It's yeah. fine. Oh, geez, tongue too. Huh? He could be persuaded. We'll meet in the Tarn Valley in two nights' time. Where's he going? He's looking for more hands to help. What a cute miniature. That's a huge town. <laughs> Why me? I'm a coward. <laughs> couldn't you just fly back and tell him you couldn't find me? Oh, all right, I'm coming. He can talk to animals, too. Where are we? We're about to enter the city. He doesn't even live in the city? Oh, he left to go get something and come back because he's allowed to go in out as a citizen. All this effort, that fucking ring's just like telling him exactly what's happening. He was getting you know, straw for the sacrificial fire. This feels like a trap. Totally. There's things. Things in there. What are those? Robotic something. You guys stay there. On, yeah. I know the fact that they watch that happen and they're like, okay, our turn. Yeah. <laughs> Not the brightest crayons in the box. Also, if she's a slave, don't you think she would have been in this building at some point? They were taking her to sacrifice. Oh, like you don't she's think she would have before? ever been in this building? They probably used a different entrance for the girlfriend. You're backstabbing already. She does know her way around. The young priests will encase his body in deadly armor. Now they will drain his blood and damage his brain. It'll kill anything it meets. Great. That's what was in those yep. cages. Yeah, just BDSM things. You know, I'll cut and put her like, yeah, that's all right. Ah! Uh oh. Uh, one of them's loose. Oh, she went to get some new clothes. Trap. 
Seems too easy. He's dead. In no eyes. the ceiling. He's like, up! Up! I think you can use the tiger's eyes. their septic lines. You're gonna have shit all over the place later. You're gonna have a lot of work to fix all these doors. <laughs> Four poop shoots. Which one do you take out of here? Protect them. Or you think this trap door goes? Don't know. Oh, that's broken. They're still bringing the keys they don't really need anymore. I know. Sweet things. A little late. <laughs> How'd she get back out? Come on. We can try to escape the airship. How the hell did you get here? She knows her way around. Here he comes! He just kill all those guys in the hallway, you think? Yeah. He's a killing machine. What'd she tie it off to? Coda's like, shit! I almost <laughs> fell out! Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Perfect timing. I think you didn't catch that other guy. No kidding. That would have been like... Mm. Oh, no! The gate's closed! Does the gate have a counterweight? Yes. You two are going to open that gate for us. They're not heavy enough to... Counteract a counterweight. It's like, oh, I finally get to eat these guys, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Teamwork. Oh, um, those ropes are pretty dense. It's gonna take a minute. Ooh, right in the eye. Not the kind of nibble you want. Nice jump. Imagine me, the guy that had to like throw the ferrets from the top. <laughs> throw it up. Thirty-five warriors, 
strong and good are more than enough to crush me. Somebody help the blind guy around the fire so he doesn't fall in. <laughs> Succeed in killing Mayax and the priest, you will only bring down the wrath of the Jun Horde. I've seen what they can do. Who is this man? He is the Beastmaster. He is a freak. But, Father. I need no coward by my side! Oh, harsh. Yeah. Like, fine, I'll take my tiger and go home. Go crawl down a hole with your animals. Well, he's very... Pretty you know, judgmental. Yeah. I'm very, you know, thankful for his rescue. Will you go with me now? I cannot leave. Then I'll stay with you. Even that's impossible now. He has ordered you out. No one will challenge. Now that he called you a weirdo, nobody's gonna want to hang out with you. Once you're labeled a freak, you're branded for life. Yes, we are outnumbered, but our blood is boiling for revenge. We will end our humiliation. King Zay, my loyal warrior. You're blind. You almost caught yourself on fire two minutes ago. said we must run mayax knows our plan many years ago mayax killed my queen and took my unborn son that's dar's father do you think he's a horse whisperer too definitely but he's bringing him a horse what happened to gary she was trapped as was death and death on the boy to the sacrifice at sunset Wow, they really went with their horrible plan very quickly, didn't they? Yeah. It's a good thing Dar doesn't hold hard feelings for him being called a freak. Well, Zed, you really fucked that one up. Yeah. This is what you call a rescue. I better hurry, though. That was definitely not take one, because there was a huge hole in the wall right next to him. <laughs> <laughs> This guy really needs to get some new henchmen. Yeah, they're horrible at their job, aren't they? The only thing they do well is fall. Zed, join your lost son. Is Zed dead? Probably. Freaking witches. Turned into a dove, flew away. Seems like too pure of an animal for a witch to turn into. For sure. Fight to the top! There's no one left to fight. <laughs> Just gotta fight the stairs. He sacrificed himself. Oh, poor Kodo. Oh, what man. a good little buddy. Oh, shit. We must fight! No! We must flee! It's your decision now. 
would fight. I mean, he's the older brother. I don't even think they realize they're brothers. No. I mean... He... No, I don't even think he knows that his dad was the king. Well, he, he just told him that Zed was his dad. Yeah. Okay. So Dar's got to be putting the pieces together. Go! Go! Go for your freedom! They're going to free these horses? <laughs> Hester! What are we doing? Oh, trying to pretend like the moat isn't there. Trying to just make it look like dirt. Just hoping everybody falls into this little tiny moat. Yeah. He's like, go get these crazy assholes. <laughs> They'll eat anything. You moved the bridge, though. How are you going to get them on the right side of the moat? Oh, boy. That's a lot of them. It's kind of about whether or not the horses are dumb enough to jump into it. Mm. Jesus, Charlie, God, she scared the crap out of me. <laughs> she was literally just standing right behind your shoulder, like staring. <laughs> Her, just her head. <laughs> Scared the crap out of me. What are you doing? Well, I accidentally turned back on the TV when, um, I, when the movie was over, and now okay. I don't know what to do. We'll just go to bed, and we'll fix it. I was, I, I'm trying to turn it off, but it won't turn off. It's okay. I'll turn it off later. Why don't you just go get in your bed and get but to it's sleep? Like, but it's like it's is, almost ten o'clock. Is it loud? No, it's just, I don't want it like that, and maybe sleeping in there. Oh, I'll turn it off as soon as we're done with this, which we're is in 10 done. minutes. Yeah, we're almost done. So, hey. So just head to your bed, Hey, and we'll, we'll take care of the What's TV. the deal? Are you okay? You're all fidgety. I'm just tired. Yeah, you just need to go lay down in your room, okay? Go get in bed. Can you go get in your bed? Okay. Sure. Yeah, sure. Just don't you go get in your bed and I'll come give you hugs and kisses as soon as we're done and I'll turn off the television in that room, okay? okay. Alright, love you, thank you. So if this is tar or oil, couldn't they light it on fire? I think that's the plan. Yeah. Well, geez, why are we just standing around watching it? Uh oh. Oh no. Dang. He's only been king for a day. Not even. Just a few hours. Somebody's gotta light this shit on fire. Well, that'll do it. Baby, they're a firework. Come on and let's watch them burn. Get it? Make them go. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, horses jump far. I was like, oh, I was like, oh, my leg. There's more coming out of the fire, left and right. Went for being an arrow in the chest to now just kind of being like an arrow in the shoulder. Maybe he'll be okay. Single combat? Ew. You should just talk to that guy's horse and be like, hey, what are you doing? Yeah. Buck him off, please. 
Ooh. Goodbye, Wing. That's going to make his equilibrium all off, right? Yeah. Now he's going to be walking around like this. <laughs> Nailed it. Oh. Now it's just stuck at him. How do you kill this guy? Throw him in the fire. <laughs> I thought this was single combat. That means you guys should run. Uh, means, I mean, he won the duel. They should all have to throw themselves in the fire. They're going to be eating good tonight. That's what it was. It was a meal ticket. It's like, turn this in, we'll come eat. Y'all better get back inside. Let's get out of here. Yeah. Just bones dropping everywhere. Oh, shit. That'd be pretty terrifying that those things can fly. Beastmaster. Oh, if that didn't kill him, he should be all right. He won't have the use of his left hand for a while, but he's well. Nice. It was you who was first born, and it is you who should be king. You train Tall well, and he will make a fine king. He already has the strongest right hand that any leader of men could want. He doesn't want to be with his family, though? It wasn't his family. By birth, yes, but... Guess he's not into her anymore? Apparently not. Yeah, I guess they're they're cousins. Yeah. Didn't Seth say he would be maybe it, maybe it's on his mom's side. Oh, different but, mom. Yeah. yeah. Then they're not really cousins at all. He gave him a super cool knife. Oh, she's been chasing him for a while. She wants him to be her beast master. Does that mean one was a dad and one was some? Aww. Legit, she's just been walking behind him forever. <laughs> All for this aerial makeout sesh. <laughs> oh, nice. All right. Beast master. All right. Well, the Beastmaster. Honestly, if you think of it as like a made-for-TV movie, mm -hmm. not bad. Yeah, it wasn't made for TV, but no, it was theatrical release. It actually didn't do well at the theaters. No shit. <laughs> but everybody in the late eighties, early nineties, it was all over TV. <laughs> everybody knows Beastmaster. It hit syndication and it became a cult classic. And then it spawned two sequels in the nineties. Oh, nice. Actually, one of my favorite sequels, the second one, Dar goes through a time portal and comes to 1990s LA. Oh, And it's a boy. fun, you know, like, fish out of water story. Yeah. Like, what was it? Predator 2? Or... or, like, Crocodile Dundee. Yeah. But <laughs> he's a, I love Crocodile Dundee. It's Dar, the Beastmaster in All modern right. day. So. All right. But sadly, I, don't, I can't find that one on home video. Oh. Fun to watch. <laughs> but all you in the comments, you know, you've seen Beastmaster 2 through the time portal. Oh, boy. So, so yeah. Honestly, I hadn't seen this in like 30 years. It holds it, up pretty it, good. It, huh? it wasn't that bad. No, it's not that bad. It's pretty good. Great creatures uh, training. 
all the yeah. animal action, good stuff. Yeah, you gotta like that they use real animals and yeah. that those real they animals do, do a great anymore. job. They really don't. The tiger painted black. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, that was maybe not us. Awesome. Just leave the fucking tiger. <laughs> right? I think he's just a tiger in the second one because they're like, oh, we can't just paint him again. Let's just, Feels let's wrong. just say it's a tiger. But, uh, Why does it need to be a jaguar? Just leave it a fucking yeah. tiger. We don't know where you are in the world anyway, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. But uh, always heartbreaking when Kodo dies. Is it Kodo? Kodo or was Kodo. it Poto that Kodo's died? Kodo's the mom. Kodo is the dad. Oh, okay. And then they just had. Momo and Dodo. The two new babies. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. You name them. Sounds great. So, yeah. I think Kodo and Poto are both in the sequel. They, they kind of retcon that. It. Like, it was too Kodo heartbreaking died, yeah. <laughs> for the one ferret today. Yeah. Tanya Roberts. I didn't realize that she was the mom from that 70s show. That Donna's mom. Airheaded mom. Yeah, I don't really remember Donna's mom at all, so... Yeah. I never watched a ton of that 70s show. What was your favorite moment of Beastmaster? I mean, it was all like one big action <laughs> adventure movie, right? I don't know that all of the moments were pretty similar. Yeah. I don't have one. You don't have one? Okay. Well, at least he's got a half-brother he can go visit every now and then. Yeah. Yeah, village he saved. I love that his dad would, like, if something was just a fucking idiot. <laughs> you're a freak and you saved just, me they from just my kill prison him. <laughs> and they just kill him you're a freak because you talk to animals <laughs> see jeez if you'd seen his mark on his hand but he didn't have any eyes you right. would have known dumbass well yeah next we get to watch Conan the Barbarian sweet Yeah. These, this movie came out in 1982 and Conan came out in 1982 they came out oh, okay. months apart Interesting. The early 80s was very sword and sorcerer heavy. There's a lot of... And, and like, shirtless yeah, muscles. Muscle. I mean, everybody gets to look at hot bodies. Yeah. Yeah, this. I feel bad for those uh, witches. Yeah. Had who, to put on, like, pig faces. Yeah, who have, I mean, <laughs> rocking bodies, right? And then have to put on these disgusting faces. Nobody even knows <laughs> who, who they, they are, are or like, what they actually look like. I was... Which woman number two? Yeah, they could have been really popular yeah. if we had seen their faces. Well, right? There they are in the credits. They might. Chrissy Kellogg and Janet Jones and Janet DeMay. Those, that sounds like. Like Playboys. Yeah. Right? They're <laughs> probably play, Playboy gals at some point in time. They had to wear pig faces for this movie. Bummer. Didn't know what they were signing up for that one. Yeah. Well, anywho, what's your favorite part about Beastmaster? Yeah. Which animal is your favorite? Yeah, that's or a good one. animals, if you like the ferrets. Right? Mm -hmm. Ferrets are always my favorite. Totally. So, yeah. Let us know all your thoughts on Beastmaster. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for hanging out with me. Are you on repeat? Are you skipping? Do I need to, like... Thanks for hanging out with us for Beastmaster. Come back next week for Conan. Yeah, later this week. Oh, all right. And check out our Patreon link down below for early access to our videos. Follow the comment and access to polls. Up to watch next. Links down there. Check it out. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.